our home. Our only home is a luminous jewel in the cold and dark. A singular miracle because it is alive. As far as we know, this is the only place in the cosmos where life exists. Plants and animals interacted with oceans and continents, creating a world with a climate ideally suited for us. Over the eons, we were shaped by the living Earth and we have shaped it in return. Ingenious invention is our hallmark. There seemed no challenge we could not meet. We even reached for the stars. But the most wondrous thing we discovered there was a new perspective on our fragile oasis. Fragile because humanity has always lived within a narrow range of favorable climate, sustained by the balance between plants and animals, the ocean and the atmosphere. But that is changing, and changing faster than anyone imagined. Burning fossil fuels is pumping carbon dioxide into our atmosphere so fast that the global temperature is rising faster than ever before. A million species could become extinct. The changing climate is tearing our world apart. Superstorms shatter lives, while rising seas invade our cities. Wildfires devour our homes, and threaten the forested lungs of our planet. Drought and flood conspire to destroy our crops. These devastating disasters bring loss of life, famine, mass migration, even war. Can our civilization survive? Can we? But there's reason for hope. Nations around the globe have joined in the Paris Agreement and have begun the heroic effort needed to fight the climate crisis. Countries and businesses are starting to make the right choices for their economies and for our future. And wherever that work has begun, the United Nations Development Program is there to help. As part of the United Nations, UNDP is supporting governments, businesses, and communities to innovate and create a more prosperous and equitable world. We work with our partners to help people around the globe turn to clean energy, increase resilience to disaster, and protect nature so that it can protect us. Improving lives today and building a better tomorrow. But these solutions must be scaled up. We need bolder, more urgent action as our young people are demanding. All across the globe, youth movements are using social media to connect and organize. They are pleading with us to act now, before it is too late. Policymakers need to translate their commitments into actions because they have made commitments already, but they are not translating them into real actions in their countries. Those children who are 10 years old now will not live to see their grandchildren. And that is not okay. I want my children to live in a safe planet, basically. I feel like preparing for the events that might come in the future will be impactful now rather than later. You might as well take action now and not just make us proud, but save us. 
the young have the most to lose and remind us that we've no time to lose. At the United Nations, we believe we can build a healthier, sustainable world where people flourish and cultures thrive. But we must do it together, and we must do it now. We promise to do all we can to fight the climate crisis, to drive ambition, accelerate action, and mobilize change. At UNDP, we want to make sure all voices are heard and accelerate results through time-tested solutions and new cutting-edge technologies. In a clinic powered by solar energy with the help of UNDP, a new fragile life begins. Born into a world on the brink, she has everything to win or lose in this climate crisis. Her future is in our hands. Join us in making a better world for her and for us all.